Hey, what's going on? Steve Sprint, QualityAtBats.com. Got a question from the Academy. How do you help young hitters understand timing? Timing's everything, bro, right? This, this is about being on time. This is my whole thing about not trying to hit 94 and 79 at the same time, right? It's like my blackjack analogy, right? We all play blackjack a little bit, a little 21. There's too many hitters hit like they got 16 on them, oh, oh, uh, like, like you're going to bust or you're going to strike out. Right? I told this to Trumbo one time. He's like, dude, we're splitting aces here. I don't have to swing. He said, that's your best analogy ever. But what happens is we think we got to hit everything. Oh, I'm going to sit fastball and adjust. Really? It's not that easy, bro. Got a guy throwing 98. It might be at my head, but it might be a slider in the dirt. Why would I want to try and hit them all? Right? This is how you watch the game and why you watch the game. and You see what he's got thrown. If he's not throwing his breaking ball, his off speed over, he's a one-pitch pitcher. And like I've always said, if I'm sitting on a fastball and I get a fastball, guess what that's called? It's called harder BP. That's all it is. And how come we can hit a breaking ball machine in the cage and it turns invisible during the game? Because we know it's coming in the cage. But until I get two strikes from me, bro, I'm in control in this box, and I'm not going to try and hit 98 and 78 at the same time until I have to. And this is why you watch the game. When you're watching the game on TV, right? Stop watching it like you're a fan. You tell me you want to play in the big leagues? Right? Watch it like you're going to get in that bat. Start thinking with the pitcher. Get your buddy or your dad or your mom or whoever you're watching the game with. Get a piece of paper and a scorecard and put F for fastball and O for off speed. And see how many times you can be right. Trust me, this is creating instincts to play the game. And this is what we're looking for. We're looking for instincts. When I used to scout for the Dimebacks and I was a cross tracker and our area guy would come in, and, I, and I, I, I promise you every single one of his players, I asked him how his instincts were. And if he fudged this much without saying great, I'm not voting for that kid. It's hard enough to play in the big leagues with instincts. If you don't have them, it's impossible. So let's create instincts. Let's learn how to watch the game, right? Let's learn how to be on time. That pitcher's job is to get me off time. Well, my job is to be on time. And if I'm sitting on a fastball, bro, it's going to be my pitch, not if. Take the if out of your swing. Oh, if it's a fastball, well, if it's a break, well, if it's a strike. It's too much hesitation. Right? It's going to be my pitch. And I got slow feet, fast hands, quiet head, taking a controlled, violent swing. And if I can't drive it, oh, oh, buddy, I ain't swinging.